From all the secret presents you can unlock right now to this portal device that is being built for a live event. Here are 24 secrets coming up in Chapter 4 Season 1. Please like, subscribe, and use code SMJM. Here is a look at Deku's Smash, a brand new mythic ability slash weapon. This works a little bit like Kamehameha in the sense that you would have to like charge the weapon before you shoot it. The only difference is rather than shooting a beam of energy, you are shooting like a shockwave. You charge it up, you do like a dash, then you shoot like this shockwave that can destroy an entire building. Here is an example. Charging it up and then you shoot like this, you do a dash and then you destroy an entire building. This works really great with like a build mode. If someone's boxed up, you can charge and shoot and they will get damaged. Now this is one of the main characters, All Might. He comes with two different versions, this one and this little skinny dude version. And this little polar bear is like his back bling. This is how his pickaxe looks like. And it's called Alt Might. And he comes with two emotes. This is the first emote. You're basically flexing. You get like this gleaming light around him. And his second emote is this one that's basically transform himself into the skinnier version of him. And also you can transform yourself back to All Might again. We also get a bunch of other characters as well. Deku, who's the main character of the show. This is Deku's skin. And also we've got All Might figurine back bling. Also we are getting this female skin. And this is Katsuki Bakugo, his superpowers is explosion. I hope we get his mythic weapon as well. That would be sick. All of these are available as a bundle for 4,000 V-Bucks. And also you can get a bunch of these back blings as well. You'll also get this Deku's emote. It's called Azuku's Quirk and it's basically lightning coming out of his body. Fortnite was going to do a live stream showcasing their Unreal Engine Creative 2.0. And in the live stream, they announced that they were having technical difficulties and they didn't end up doing it. Initially, Tim Sweeney did announce that the Creative 2.0 was going to be released in January. So I think they're going to wait until January to announce Creative 2.0. There is a glitch that will allow you to get 2 billion XP points. According to FNBR Intel, you need to follow these steps in order to get this XP point. And not just that, you can also claim the skins you can get in the Christmas present early as well. Because obviously right now you would have to wait until the end to claim those skins. Now players who did this glitch did not get banned. People are saying that this glitch has been fixed but some people are saying it's still working. So there's a bit of a confusion right now but I recommend you guys don't do this glitch just in case. Obviously a new year is approaching fast and in Fortnite every year they do like this small event and for the past few years they've been using the same event over and over again but this year is going to be different. You can see See right here, this is the event that you're going to see every hour. Also, usually if we play a Fortnite game during this event, you get some sort of like a present. I'm guessing it's going to be something like this. It looks like Fortnite are working on some kind of portal gate. You can see a plan on top of this tower and also a bunch of material as well. It looks like someone's trying to leave the map or trying to bring someone back to the map. Now, Vintix created this rift portal device in Creative and this is how it looks like. I don't know how he did it, but he managed to make it work as well. And I believe once this device is being built, it will look exactly like this. The only thing is, where can we go through this rift? The CEO of Fortnite announced that in the future, you will be able to create your own skin in Fortnite. So basically, anyone will be able to like create their own icon skin. This can all be done in Creative 2.0. Fortnite are slowly changing changing all of these sounds to AI generated. Recently, they enabled a meta sound AI generated for skydiving, ice, surface, and wind. They also made the campfire sound AI as well. Basically, every time you hear these sounds, it's gonna be different. The next celebrity icon skin is going to be this guy right here, who is an NBA player. He also has a show on Disney Plus, and we know that every time there is a show on Disney Plus, we get a collaboration in Fortnite. Donald Musk Mustard brother, Mustard plays got banned from playing in the Mr. Beast tournament. Now, if you guys don't know, on 17th of December, Saturday, Mr. Beast is going to have a tournament. The prize pool is going to be $1 million. It is going to be like a squid game kind of game mode in creative. And you can only win money if you end up first place, which is $1 million. Now, one of the rules suggests that if you are the family members or friends of someone that works at Epic Games, you 
cannot participate. Now, this is a rule that they have. Even in sports, you can't do this. So, Mustard Place is not allowed to play in this tournament. Now, this emote was found in the files, and you can tell this is obviously Midas. Fortnite has been teasing us Midas for a while now. This spray was added in the files. Also, Donald Mustard himself said that Midas is still alive. Now, we're not sure exactly when we are going to get Midas, but I believe it's going to be in Season 2, because we saw Midas for the first time in Chapter 2, Season 2. And you never know, this device that's been created right now is maybe Midas, because he knows how to create devices. You can get a refund if you bought this Mr. Beast glider. Fortnite accidentally charged too much V-Bucks for this glider, so they basically put out this. We are aware of the issue where the wrapped and revved glider was priced higher than intended. This has been fixed. We will grant 400 V-Bucks to players who previously purchased this glider separately from the Mr. Beast bundle. So basically, you will not get the 400 V-Bucks if you bought the bundle, which includes this glider. Only if you just bought this glider from the item shop, you will be granted 400 V-Bucks. So just go ahead and claim that from the item shop if you bought this. Epic gave us this spray as one of the presents. This spray is of this guff version. This guff skin was also seen in the survey. Now I'm guessing that we are going to get this skin for free. And this skin is exactly the same as this skin right here, Lieutenant Evergreen, which we got for free for Christmas. I believe we will get this skin for free as well. Now just a reminder that Reboot Rally is live right now and you can claim a bunch of these rewards. To win these, all you have to do is play with a friend who hasn't played Fortnite in a while. You have to earn 50 points to get the unfocus emotes, 100 points to get the controlled focus wrap, 150 points to get vision board glider, 200 points to get the Wolverine emote. Now we were supposed to get this pickaxe as well, but for some reason Fortnite removed it. If you guys have not noticed, the fridge in the Winterfest cabin changes every day. Maybe at some point we will see like a free reward in there. But if you want this Adeline Arctic skin earlier, all you have to do is open these presents you can see tick marked. After that, you will be able to unwrap the tall green, which is the Adeline skin. You can unlock this curling emote for free. Now, if you want to unlock the skin, all you have to do is play with five different friends from your friends list in any game mode during the Winterfest period, which is going to be December 13th till January 3rd. Also, if you play on PC, don't forget to claim this version of the guff from the item shop. It is for free. And also, if you play on console, don't worry. All you have to do is download GeForce Now on your laptop or your phone. Log in using your Epic Games account and claim this skin.